Hi, Mark Kohler here with another tax and legal tip. Let's talk about comparing the Roth 401k with the Roth IRA. I get a lot of phone calls with clients asking, Mark, which one's best for me? Now this is a complex topic, but let's see what we could do and break down the basics. Okay, let's go to the whiteboard and put them in two different columns. See if that'll help make more sense of it. Let's start with the Roth IRA first. Uh, more people are familiar with the IRA or Roth IRA, been around a little longer. And then we'll put the Roth 401k over on this side. Now there's pros and cons to both, but let's start with the Roth IRA. Um, maybe we'll contrast what's good and bad, because again, everybody's a little different. But you can only put 5,500 into a Roth IRA or 6,500 with catch up if you're over age 50. Now there's also some income limitations. So if you make too much money, you can't even do this, which is probably one of the cons, right? Limitations. Um, you cannot borrow against your IRA, so that's another problem uh, when you start comparing them with the Roth 401k. Um, but the Roth IRA is simple, it's easy, and it's cheap to set up, so that's easy and affordable. So you've got these different options, and if some of you want to get into a Roth IRA, watch my video on the Roth conversion, because there's no income limits on a Roth conversion. But when I have a client looking to put away a lot more money, and even self-direct and get a little more creative with some lending, we might want to go to the Roth 401k. All right, now let's compare the Roth 401k and go over here. Now the first benefit we like is you can put away a lot more money, $18,000, $24,000, that's a $6,000 makeup if you're over age 50. So you can see here, kind of a big deal. Now the next benefit is there's no limitations here when it comes to your income level. You can make a million dollars and still put money in a Roth 401k. So like that, no limitations on income. Also with a 401k, you can borrow against it. Borrowing provisions are pretty cool. We gotta love the borrowing provisions if you wanna suck some money out of the 401k and use for personal reasons. Now the con here in this situation is in order to take advantage of this, you've gotta have a small business. You've gotta have some small business income. So, uh, I typically see our clients with S corporations with ordinary income really funding the Roth 401k. The other con is you've got your setup cost. We charge around 1200 bucks. You're gonna see that or more out there. If you have multiple employees, it could get a little more expensive. But I would say I'd budget around $1,200 for setup and we charge around $400 a year and you get to be your own trustee and maintain the checkbook. No stockbrokers are taking a percentage of this. This is for you to self-direct your own 401k which I'd like to summarize with that. With both of these plans, you can self-direct and you can invest in what you know best. Watch some of my other videos on this strategy. But with a 401k, you can borrow inside your 401k to do investments with no UDFI. That's unrelated debt financed income. Another deep concept, but you have UDFI when you borrow money inside a Roth IRA and you're self-directing. Bottom line, this is a complex topic as you can see and something you should debate with your accountant or financial advisor. Be open to self-directing. Don't let an advisor tell you you can't do this. It's usually that they can't do it, but you can. Look at your options, even if you have employees, as to what you can do with a Roth 401k. Again, talk to your advisor, big topic. We'd love to help you, but uh, catch, uh, keep catching these tips and we hope to better help you live your American dream. Thanks for listening and I hope that information was helpful. And let me speak from the heart here. I've been talking about topics like this for 10, 15 years. I'm a CPA, attorney, best-selling author, radio show host, and I am passionate about helping small business owners save taxes, build wealth, and protect it. Please check out the link right here. Download my free ebook on 10 common mistakes small business owners make in the tax and legal arena. Also, check out my uh, social media links here. I've got daily tips, a weekly blog, radio show every week. This information is free and I'd love to help you. Click below, find out more about me, and thanks for listening.